This is the point we have pinpointed in your timeline, sir. This is when you go back and give yourself this. You'll know what to say. You already heard yourself say it. It does not matter if it is not exactly right. The time stream will not be damaged. Just make sure that you give yourself this. It is our best hope for the future of the galaxy. You'll return to this exact point in time as soon as you have done what you need to do. The galaxy still needs your blade, Dahar Master. Are you prepared? You are the second officer aboard a Klingon bird of prey, currently in charge of the Night Watch. You are in command of the ship, while Captain Churlick and First Officer Duran are off duty. Your shift nears its end. Third Officer Lieutenant Kagan would like to have a word with you before you leave the bridge. People you can interact with have icons above their heads. Press A to talk with them. The end of the shift is near, at last. I have updated the duty logs. Not that there was a lot to report. Still, we have our duties. You will need to approve the logs before the captain arrives. Unless you are fond of cleaning up after his targ. The logs are up on my station now. Use it to transfer them into the record of battle. <laughs> battle. The only battle we face is against the forces of boredom. We are warriors of the Empire. We should be finding glory against Starfleet in honorable combat, not flying through empty space. You have completed a task by approving the duty logs. Return to your contact, Lieutenant Kagan. I hope the logs didn't bore you too much. I almost fell asleep writing them. If you'd like something more entertaining, I've made some adjustments to the standard disruptor training program on the holodeck. I think you'll find them interesting. Captain on the bridge! Kagan kept my ship from blowing up during your watch. Kalos would be proud. I relieve you. Return in six hours, Lieutenant. You are dismissed.
You are now a Delta recruit. You have a unique trait that gives bonus dilithium ore to you and your teammates. I dreamt we hadn't run out of blood wine last week. <sighs> if only that were true. I think Captain Jurlak knows something we don't. It is hard to sleep when we could be in battle at any time. The Gino this thing spits out isn't fit for a targ. Whoever programmed the replicator should be shot. I can't make anything close to decent food. Lieutenant Durand's Parma works on Kronos. I went through training with him. Great engineer, terrible gambler. There is only one worthy human delicacy. It is called Haggis. Have you tried that human drink? Prune juice? <sighs> it is a warrior's drink. to receive your prisoner. Acknowledged. We're beaming the piece of Bakhtok to you, now. I recommend you muzzle him. The sound of his voice is irritating. If he irritates me, I will feed him to my favorite talk, piece by piece. <laughs> Something useful. Approach the armory lock and 
from the Federation borders? My suspicions about our Pataka the captain have been confirmed. I've been seeing signs of Jurlik's cowardice and incompetence for months now. But finally, this is the proof I need to challenge him. I see that you are near the brig. I want you to talk to the Federation prisoner there. Find out why he is so valuable. And then report back directly to me. Kapla! Rescue attempt has failed. Something on your mind, second officer? You do know your captain is a traitor, right? And now two of you know. That's a start. Tell me. Does Duran know about Jurlek's dishonor as well? Well then, I'm guessing you'll be first officer before too long. Can't imagine Duran letting something like that slide. How do you know so much about our crew, Starfleet? It's my business to know things. If I were you, I'd check in with soon-to-be Captain Duran. She'll probably want to talk about your promotion. 
I'm afraid First Officer Duran is indisposed. Permanently. Report to the bridge at once. Unless you wish to join her in Stovacor. Well, I was half right. Congratulations on your promotion, First Officer. The captain has dishonored himself. You are the next ranking officer. It is your right to challenge him to a duel, to the death. If you defeat him, the ship is yours. Go, you know what must be done. There is no sign of the Segpa on scanners. We do not know if the Feds destroyed her, but I suggest we not worry about that just yet. 
Engines and shields are operational, but we need Iridium to facilitate immediate repairs to other systems, and our Iridium stores were lost in the ambush. Fortunately, there are some asteroids in the vicinity that might have what we need. Press up to it. Gagan has joined your crew. Stop! Captain, I recommend we use the scanners to see if this contains any iridium. No iridium on the scanners, but that nearby asteroid field may have what we need. Use your mini or press the mute button to see where your next objective is. on the D-pad to activate and deactivate full impulse. Helm, full stop! Captain, I stopped the ship. We have found several asteroids that contain Iridium, Captain. Ashka! Starfleet distress signal. Seems that a frigate looking for us took a hit in a nearby asteroid field. They are disabled. They won't be out of action for long. I suggest we put an end to their hunt while we can. What are your orders, Captain? You must be within 10 kilometers of an enemy. <laughs> are jamming our sensors. We can't get a lock on the Segpa while they do. We have determined the location of the ships that are jamming us, however. We should eliminate them so we can continue our search for the Segpa. It will be a tough fight, but the crew hungers for battle. I think we're up for the challenge.
your orders, Captain? Activate your cloaking device to hide from enemy First, order Enemy ships destroyed. Jamming effect neutralized. We are clear to resume our search for the Segpa, Captain. Your orders? Officer, make a report to command. Give them our coordinates and tell them we are moving to assist the Segpa in battle. Klingon Defense Force and reinforcements to fight are another day. In. Failure to comply means we'll disable your ship and take the prisoner by force. It looks like Starfleet wants a fight. Shall we give them one, Captain? You're making a huge mistake. Command is expecting him. 
You probably want to space him by now. I know I did. But that would be a career-ending move for you. Just get him to Kronos. Congratulations, warrior. has been received and muzzled. Typical human, in love with the sound of his own voice. Oh, some stuffy bureaucrat tried to reach you here. Word about your promotion has traveled fast, it seems. I suggest you present yourself to the High Council and get the formalities out of the way. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 